Hey, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm Rebecca. So today, y'all, hip hip hooray, it is front door fashion day. Oh, it's like one of my favorite days of the month. I love front door fashion. Oh my gosh, it is just my absolute favorite box, I have to say, thus far. I mean, I like a lot of different boxes, but y'all, this one is just the holy grail of fashion subscription boxes. Oh, let me tell you a little bit about Front Door Fashion. So, with Front Door Fashion, you work one-on-one -on -one with a stylist. Once you sign up for a box, they will contact you either by phone, by text, or by email. It's completely up to you how you want to be contacted. You'll fill out a pretty extensive a style profile before they get in touch with you, and then they kind of go over some things, just ask some different questions about things that you're looking for, so they kind of get a better feel for what you're, you're wanting. My stylist's name is Rachel, and I've been working with her since the very beginning, and I have to say, this girl has just completely figured out my style. <laughs> And that's hard to do. And I I am one of, the, I feel like I'm probably one of the hardest people to style at this point. I'm on a weight loss journey, as most of you know. So I am losing weight as I go, but I'm so particular about different types of clothes that I wear right now because I'm not comfortable in so many different things. So I've told them no shorts, no skirts, no dresses. Now that's hard to style somebody that will not accept any of those things, especially for spring and summer. <laughs> so once I get a little bit more comfortable with the size that I am, then I can start incorporating some of those things back in my wardrobe. But for right now, I'm just not into it. I'm kind of difficult to style. <laughs> so God bless them because I can tell you, I, I'm just, you know, that's a hard job. It would be a hard job for me for sure because I can't put anything together. That's another great thing about Front Door Fashion is they put everything together for you. When I open this box, you're gonna see things come rubber banded that can be mixed and matched and that is what people like me need. And so, <laughs> yeah, this, this box, this service is so important to me. It just makes my life so much easier. I came out with some amazing looking outfits that um, have been professionally curated just for me. So that means a lot. Another thing I do too with my stylist is that in communicating with her, especially when I order a new box, I'll send her pictures of things that I have and say, hey, can you style something to go with this? Or do you have anything that you know would go with this? And most of the time she will come up with something for me. Another thing too I like about Front Door Fashion is that once you start using the service and you keep some of the items, then they start building on that wardrobe. So, you know, you'll have new things come through, but then they'll tell you, you know, you can wear this top with these pants that you already own. She knows what I have based on what I've gotten from them. So, you know, that's very helpful too because I'm, I'm just terrible. I can't, literally can't put anything together. It's just such an amazing service for me. There's no styling fee, but they do require a $100 deposit for the box because there's usually anywhere from, you know, $1,500 to over $2,000 worth of clothes that they send you. But the pricing for Front Door Fashion, it's more on a boutique level. Uh, most items, average price is around $100 per item, but you know, like said, that's average. So you'll find a few things that are a little bit more, and then you'll find things that are even less. Um, you select your budget based on your, um, your style profile. I put everything of mine at the very bottom. Um, the very bottom level on every single thing. So, you know, so occasionally you will get pieces 
that are a little bit more, but maybe they went with some of the outfits that they were putting together for you. And so they just threw that in, you know, yeah, it's a little over budget, but you know, this may be something that, that she wants to keep. She may have some other things to go with this. So, you know, they, they try to stay within the budget that you choose for them, but sometimes it does go over a little bit. Everything that you um, don't want will go back into this box and you can take this back to FedEx. Um, I have a little um, store down the street from me that accepts FedEx. I just take it there, they scan it, and there's a, a label to go back. No um, charge for shipping, either way. And then the $100 deposit that you put down towards your box, if you keep anything, then they will take from that until that's gone, and then they will charge you for the rest that you keep. If you keep nothing, you send everything back, then they will credit that $100 back to your credit card. Um, there's no cost to you whatsoever. There's no risk. You know, you keep what you want, send everything else back, and you're done. Let's get into this box and see what Miss Rachel has picked out for me today. I'll be right back. We'll start this trial. Okay, so a couple other things too. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, be sure to do that because y'all don't want to miss a thing with unboxings and my weight loss journey and with recipes coming up for healthy meals. You certainly don't want to miss any of that. So be sure to subscribe to the channel and click the bell so that you get notification of new videos going up. I try to get a couple up every week so you can keep up with what's going on here. And, um, and be sure to like the video because these are so much fun. Also, I have a referral link for Front Door Fashion. If you would like to give this box a, a try, then if you use my link, you will get Rachel as your stylist. So if you like what she does for me, I'm sure you're gonna like what she does for you too. All right, let's get to this box. So I have not opened this. I do not know what's in it. You don't get a preview. Like I said, I do, um, I do know, or I'm pretty sure that there are some white jeans in here that I requested. And also um, I sent her some pictures of some pants that I needed something to go with. So I think there's gonna be something like that in here too. So in your box, yeah, you can kind of see this. So you get a garment bag and I'm gonna take this out of this box. Okay, so in your garment bag, you get a note from your stylist that is going to piece all this together for you, tells you how to put every single thing together and then you also get your return postage and you get these little strips those little tape strips to take your box back up so be sure to keep your box because that's super important here is my garment bag and this thing is so heavy so i'm just going to lay this here we're going to get into that in just a second. So, Rachel says, Hey, Rebecca, thank you so much for allowing me to stay here again. I hope you love your box. Enjoy, Rachel. Okay. So, they come in collections. So, I have four collections. And you also get, like, perk credits. If you keep five items, you receive $20 in perk credit towards your next purchase. So I kept five items out of my last box. So I have $20 waiting on me too. So I've, I paid the $100. I know I'm gonna find something in here because I always do. <laughs> Plus I have the $20 perk credit. If you keep the whole box, you get a 10% discount. So um, yeah, my whole box is $1,733. So this actually is a little bit less than the last box I got. <laughs> so that's good. And um, if I kept the whole box, which I'm not going to, um, it would be $173.30. I have the $20 credit. So that would make it uh, $1,539 for me. 
there are 19 items in this box. Let's get in here and just look at it. I've got my little rack here. Can y'all see? Yeah, y'all can see that. So I like to hang things up so y'all can just see it as I'm trying on and different things. Okay, let's see. Now, you know, like I said, everything comes rubber banded that are together. Okay, oh my goodness. Okay, so look at that. Oh, so cute. Okay, I thought that was a dress, but it's not. <laughs> it's not. I thought, oh, Lord, Rachel, I'm not ready for a dress. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm going to be in so much stinking trouble. Okay, I'm not sure if this goes for this collection or the other collection. So I've got this one. I'll find out in a minute. It's got this cute little jacket. Oh, there's some pants in there. A white t-shirt that I need so desperately. Gosh, I hope that's not a gazillion dollars. That is so cute. Oh, y'all, this stuff. I have this little out, these little tops. Such cute tops. Oh my gosh. I mean, everything is just amazing. Look at this white jacket. I don't have a white distressed jacket. <laughs> Lots of color. I didn't even ask for color, but I, you know, I thought, started to tell her, but then I was like, no, she knows. She knows what to do with me. Play. Oh, I think I see some pants I requested. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> that is so cute. And then I've got this top, and that's got to be those white distressed pants. Oh, my word. Oh, gosh. Okay. Y'all, <laughs> I'm in so much trouble. <laughs> Y'all are seriously going to have to help me out here, okay? I'm gonna get started and I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, this is the first outfit. Okay. Perfect for the summer. I thought you'd look gorgeous in this red floral kimono from Gentle Fawn. Layer it over the matching brown V neck tee. Then finish this sassy look with the distressed straight jeans provided. The kimono could also be styled with your red pants and a white tee underneath. Okay, so, and I'm going to bring those out here. I'll, I'll get them. So, these are, um, these are some white distress kits, but I don't, there's another pair over there, and I don't know if they're distressed. I thought they were. These are distressed, and these, uh, these may be the ones she was talking about, because they are Liverpool. Um, they are distressed. They've got the raw hands distressing here on the legs. Um, there's probably some distressing. Yeah, I think I feel some on the pockets too. Um, cute pants. They are a little tight, unfortunately. I was hoping she had sized up one, but she had not. This um, kimono is so stinking cute, y'all. I'm going to get close so y'all can see. It's so cute. And this v-neck t-shirt. I tucked it, but let me show you untucked. It's, I mean, it's like... It's not split on the side, but it's it comes up like it's it's really comfortable. the The fabric is very nice in this. So what I have here is the gentle fawn kimono in brown tee, Liverpool distressed white straight jeans. The kimono is fifty eight dollars. That's a really good price, especially if it's going to go with something else that I have. Clove brown tea. It's 52. It's um, General Font Lewis tea is the name of it in clove brown. $52. The Liverpool pants Kennedy um, crop straight in bone white. They are $98. 
So overall, it's not a bad price for an outfit. I really like this kimono. I'm gonna go get that other um, pair of pants and bring it out and let y'all see it with those pants too. She says red, but it's really more of a, um, I don't know what color you'd call it, but it's it's a brown, it's kind of a reddy brown color. It's not red, red, like I was thinking. And when she said, um, you'd look gorgeous in this red floral kimono. I was like, I don't see, I don't see a red floral kimono. <laughs> but I think she was talking about this because this is the only one that is like that in this group. So what do y'all think about this? Let me know your thoughts. I think it's kind of cute. And the kimono is 58. So, you know, that's a really good price. And I really like this top too. This is just a different color this clove brown. It's really nice. I kind of like it. Next outfit. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. So this is the next outfit. This says, this is the Love Token Taupe Cardigan and the Liverpool Stripe Tee. So what she says is create a chic monochromatic look with the next taupe and white stripe tee from Liverpool. Style it with the white jeans or your favorite blue jeans. Then complete your outfit with a denim jacket or the taupe duster cardigan provided. This outfit would be cute now with sandals and later with heeled booties. So I put this little, um, the little duster cardigan thing. And it is super cute. Let's see about the price. I didn't look at that. Um, pleated cardigan in beige is by Love Token. It's $148. It's got a um, little tie that ties around, but I tied it in the back because it looked fantastic, but it was, I didn't want it just let you know it's dangling. And to tie it in front, I didn't really like it for me. It's really cute. I see where she's going with it, but yeah, I won't be keeping the cardigan. The top scoop neck short sleeve tee is 44. It feels really good. This is a Liverpool. It's really cute. Really cute. And um, yeah, I have to try that with my, my blue jean jacket. I might go grab it, see what that looks like with it. But yeah, I think the cardigan is a no. Let me show you these. This is the little kimono that I had on previously. And then these were the pants that I sent her. So that with a white top is what she suggested with this. So yeah, I'm thinking this is a, a keeper. And these are the pants that I had. So, all right, y'all let me know what you think about this top. Um, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go try it with that, that denim jacket real quick and then we'll get on to the next collection. I'll be right back. Okay, so here it is with just a denim jacket, just this little striped tee. I don't know, I kinda like this little t-shirt. I think it's kinda cute. Let me know what you think. Like I said, this um, denim jacket is mine. So anyway, I just wanna try it on since she suggested it. And we're gonna move on to the next grouping. I'll be right back. Okay, so I've got this on with these pants that are mine. Um, well, it's looking a little different to me in the camera. <laughs> so, that's when I tried it on and looked in my mirror, I was like, I don't really even think I like this. Um, and I'm still not sure I do. I wish that thing laid a little bit better. It just needs to be pressed, I guess. All right, so what are your thoughts on this? I don't, I don't know. I mean, I can't see great from here, but um, let me know what you think. I think I actually like it better with this little kimono. What do you think about that? You can't see the pants if I get that close. Let me know your thoughts. Um, do you like the blazer at all? Do you like it better than the kimono? Do you like either one of them? <laughs> Let me know. Let me know your thoughts. And I'm gonna try on the next outfit. 
Okay, so this is the next outfit. These are the pants that I had on previously. These are the distressed crop flares. And this is a Be Young tank. The flare pants. Oh yeah, they're $89. I've already told y'all that. And then this top, the Be Young, it's in smoke blue mix and it's $58. It's really cute. She suggested and I had to say, y'all having some issues with video tonight. <laughs> it keeps stopping on me. Okay, so she suggested pairing it with this, this little duster. It is really cute. I just know that I won't wear this. So <laughs> there's really no sense in, um, you know, in keeping it because I, I know, I mean, I do like it. I think it's adorable, but I uh, just, don't really think um, it's going to be for me, but I'm pairing it with what she said just because I want to see what the complete looks like. The complete look looks like. So I do like this top though, and I like the colors in it. It's that fluttery sleeve. I'm going to keep this out here because I'm going to need it again. There's another top that's the Vince Camuto that I'm going to um, come and we're going to try this one too. So, y'all let me know what you, what you think about this top. I kind of like it. All right. I'll be right back. And we will have the Vince Camuto top on next. I'll be right back. Okay, so, here is the next outfit. This is the Vince Camuto top. And she said to pair it with these pants. And then, of course, the duster. Um, the Vince Camuto top. It's a scrunch strap v-neck rumple tank in brook green. It's $49. It looks really cute with this. I, I see exactly where she's going with it. I just don't think I would wear this enough to get the wear out of it. I, I just, I don't know. What do y'all think of it? Do you like it at all? Um, you know, I'm thinking more of the fall you know, I might wear it some. I don't know. I mean, this is what I this is what I end up doing. Show you this without this duster. I mean, it, gosh, you can put it with everything. You know. Oh goodness. Okay, so this top is a little bit big here. I think you know I can size down and it would fit fine. I would still have. Enough, um, it wouldn't be too tight anywhere, I don't think. If you're seeing muffin top, it's because of these pants. I know that's what it is. I started to put these on with a pair of my regular pants just so it would look a little bit better, but I just decided to keep these pants on since I had them on. But um, I do like the little straps, they're, they're really cute. I would have to wear a different bra with them with this. But anyhow, let me know what you think about this. And I will try on the next collection. We still have two collections to go, so I'll be right back. Okay, so here is the beginning of the next collection. So this is the Liverpool White Distress Denim Jacket. Super cute. Um, we've got Vince Camuto Yellow Shell and Liverpool Light Wash Straight Jeans. Let's see what she says here. I could see you adoring this distressed white denim jacket from Liverpool. It's a closet staple that is perfect for layering over your favorite sleeveless tops. Layer it over the sunshine yellow tank provided, then complete this everyday casual look with the light wash straight jeans provided. Keep your outfit casual with sneakers or sandals or dress, dress up this outfit with nude heels. See how much everything is. The jacket is $119. That's about normal for this. Vince Camuto V Rumple Blouse in Dandelion is $58. The jeans, $98. $98. So, I don't have a white denim jacket. That is very true, and I could use one. However, there's so many cute things in this box. I'm just going to have to <laughs> try to figure out what's going to best work for me. This top is really cute. 
I mean, it's just a little shell. Um, but I do like it. I mean, I can, you know, tuck it. I won't keep these pants because I have so many. I cannot do that in this camera for some reason. I had the hardest time <laughs> tucking without a mirror. That still doesn't look great. But anyway, you get the idea. Um, it's a good price for the, the top. I just don't know. I don't know. What do y'all think? Do you like it? Let me know. Okay, so I'm going to try on the next outfit with this collection, and I'll be right back. The next outfit is uh, the Ben's Canudo Kelly Green Blouse, and I still got on the Liverpool Light Wash Straight Jeans. Come down, tie front blouse, cactus green is $79. So it's a really cute blouse. Um, I like the sleeves on it. I don't really care for the tie front. You know, I think I'm just kind of, um, I have so many tops for the tie front. I just don't really think I want another one. Um, I, I don't really see anything super special about this blouse. I mean, it's a pretty color. I like the, the green color. I just don't really, there are other things I'd rather have, I think, than this. But y'all tell me what you think. What do you think about this? I've got one more top with these jeans. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, so this is the last thing in this collection, and then we move on to the very last collection. So this is the Trina Turk Hot Pink Peplum with these straight jeans. Okay, so um, this top has got that elastic right here, which drives me crazy. <laughs> if I were a lot skinnier, <laughs> this would be fine and i would love this top because i like the color i think it's very pretty it's very different it's very very unique i like it a lot however this is cool oh, it, it to me it makes me look bigger than i am and i mean i'm big enough but this does not help me any at all it is trina turk which means it's going to be expensive i know that for a fact i haven't looked at it yet so this top, um, Heron Top in Snapdragon, is $198. Yep. <laughs> yep, it is. And it's cute as a button, but it is not good for me. This is just not, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I will not be wearing this, especially at that price tag. I just can't. Can't do it. But let me know what you think about this top. What do you like? Do you like the color? That would kind of help for, for later. Maybe hot pink is, you know, a color I can can wear pretty well. I don't know. It's kind of, from what I'm saying, I like the color and I like the top. I just, that is terrible. Let me move along to the next collection and I'll be right back. Okay, y'all, this is the start of the last collection. And so this is the Love Token Snake Print Trench. Uh, I don't know what that is. It's a blue tank. And then Liverpool Distressed Crop Flares. And these pants are so stinking cute. I wish they fit me better. They just don't, but I do love them. Oh, it makes me sad. But you know, I like pants. <laughs> That's just, I'm just having the hardest time. This is the cutest thing ever. I love this little trench coat. I would not get enough wear out of it to, you know, to justify it. I don't care how much it is. It's just, I know it's gonna be more than what I wanna pay. I, I know that for a fact. Um, I do like this little tank underneath. It's almost like a cornflower blue. We'll see what it says about the, the color. Let me take this off. And you have to understand these pants are tight, so everything's moving up and not cute. But I do like the tank. Um, let's see how much everything is. So, the trench coat was 178. Yeah, I figured it was gonna be quite a bit there. Blue tank, 
coronet blue, okay, that's close, is 58, so that's not too bad. It's a ribbed, it's like a little ribbed, you'll see that. And the pants that are not gonna fit, don't fit, are uh, $98. Let me know what you think about this tank. Really like it. Well, um, I really like this, but it's not gonna justify I can't justify keeping it, unfortunately. So, we'll not be keeping that. I have one more top to try on. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the last top. And if I can find my notes here. This is the Vince Camuto Navy Ruched Top. So, it's got this, it's almost like the, um, little tank that I had earlier that was the green. It's like that, but this is like a full top. So this is really cute. It's a little big. We call this three quarters, but yeah, I guess it is. Okay, it's classic navy. It's $79. Yep. I really do like this top. It is so cute. If I didn't have so many dark colored tops like black, I have a, a couple of navy ones. I would probably size this down and keep it because I do like it. But since I already have so many, I don't really need another one. So probably won't be keeping this one either. But, you know, let me know what you think. I do like it. I like the neckline. I love this part of it. I think that that's really cute part of this top. But yeah, I think I will probably let it go. All right. I will meet you back on the couch in just a minute. Okay, y'all, what that fun. I love front door fashion. It does take a while to get through it. I appreciate you hanging out with me and getting through all that trying. Oh my goodness, it's just so much to get through. So what did y'all think about that box? Rachel always does an amazing job. Just a few things that, you know, are for sure no. A trench coat, you know, it's super cute, but I just can't justify keeping that. And um, that pink top, oh my goodness, no. That's that Trina Turk, the heron top in Snapdragon. Um, beautiful color, but yeah, it's $198, so we'll be keeping that either. Pants, they steal most of them. She didn't size me back up like she should have, probably. None of those really fit me well enough to keep them. I, I did find a pair of white distressed jeans the other day on um, another site that I'm thinking about ordering. I almost ordered them the other day, but I knew I had this box coming, and I knew that she was gonna put some distressed ones in there for me, but since those didn't work out, I think I'm gonna go back and try to order the other ones to see if they won't work for me. The striped, the fawn and white striped shirt, that was a Liverpool, I think. Yes, khaki white striped Liverpool. That was $44, that was such a great price. Um, and I really did like that too, it was really cute. The cardigan. The cardigan was the one that was 148. That goes with a gazillion things, but I just don't think I'd get enough wear out of that to keep it. Um, that's that love token. Really cute, but I just, I don't know about that. There was that gentle fawn Lewis T and um, that clove brown. I really liked that too. And that was $52. That was a good price on that too. I liked it. The kimono was adorable and it went with a lot of things that I have and um, you know, can justify it. definitely keeping that was $58. So those, you know, I think those are some good contenders there. That boxy blazer, tell me what you, your thoughts are on that blazer. I just don't know that I liked it well enough to keep it. It was $119. And then that Alabama tea in white, that was by General Fawn as well, and there's another gentle fawn top that was the clove brown. This one's the white, um, I liked it. 
and I really like the fabric on that top. Very, very nice. Other tops in that collection, that Be Young, that's that smoke blue mix. I really like that top. Uh, really cute. And then the Vince Camuto in the V-neck rumple tank in that brook green was pretty too. I liked it too. And she had it paired with that, the little duster, the cardigan. I'm calling it a duster, but it's a cardigan, that long one. It looks really cute with that. <laughs> I really did like the white denim jacket. I just think there's other things that I liked better. I mean, I could use that white jacket, but you know, I did like some of the blouses that she sent. That Vince Camuto V-neck rumple blouse in dandelion. That was that like yellow, light yellow. What'd you think about that? I can take it or leave it. That button down tie front blouse by Vince Camuto in that cactus green, really pretty. I just, I wasn't that super excited about it. Um, I, you know, I, I think there's other things I'd rather have, but it was cute and it was $79. The last collection, that trench coat, so cute, but yeah, I'm not gonna keep that. Um, that rib tank, now, I did like that. It's $58, and it was like that ribbed. It's real, it's real cute, I liked it. And then the last thing was the Vince Camuto top, the very last one I just tried on, it was that classic navy. It, if I didn't have so many dark colored tops, I would definitely size that down and keep it because I really did like it. I like the neck, I like the way it fit, other than it was a little bit big. Um, I, I really liked the top, but I don't need it. I know I got one. It's not navy blue. It's black and it is a, like more of a gauzy material, but it reminded me a lot of that top, um, that I just kept out of a, uh, a transcend box. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know, you know, what you loved, what you, you thought, eh, probably need to pass on that. <laughs> Another great box from Rachel. She just, she does it every single time. And y'all, I'm, you know, I hate that the pants didn't fit, but it's almost a blessing because I would really have a hard time trying to pick and choose the things to keep and the things to send back. So I love front door fashion and I always look forward to unboxing this with y'all. I hope that if you have, um, if you're interested in getting it, yourself giving it a shot then um my link is down below and i'd love for you to use that and get rachel because rachel's an amazing stylist so all right guys y'all it's been a long one this has taken a good long while to get this done y'all have a great rest of your day and i hope you enjoyed the trial and i'll see you back real soon see you later bye bye <music>